Hey guys, welcome back to Seashell Addicts. I'm with Callie. She was supposed to go shell hunting with me in the morning, but that never happened, mainly my fault. But look at that beautiful sunset out there. It's gonna get dark outside, and I'm gonna take you guys some, with some shell hunting, and Callie's gonna take them all the treasures that we find back to, where'd you say you're from? Indiana. Back to Indiana where it's snowing out right now. It's not snowing here, that's sand. Uh, but we're gonna go out there, find some beautiful olives, and I've got some lanterns with me to kind of light up the area so that you guys can see what we find. But right now, we're gonna go shell hunting. Guys, we'll see if Callie sees it, but there's two tiny olive shells in the circle that I've drawn. So go ahead and see if you can find them. Um, well, they're like right next to each other. Yep, there you go. One and two. Very good. All right. There is. Oh. That is an auger shell, Sweet. also known as a unicorn horn to a little girl. That's what she called it, so. I. Bigger micro olive, you see it? Yeah. Yeah, right that there. one right there. That's gonna look cool in your bottle. Yeah, it is. All right, go ahead and put it in. Perfect, cool beans. Super, super tiny. It's like the tiniest of tinies. That one right there. It is. Oh my gosh. You got it. Awesome. Three olive shells right in front of the camera here. Do you see them? See if Callie can find them. Awesome. Three of them. I'm not drawing a circle this time. I'll back away just a little bit. Okay, there's one. Yep. There is two. There is three. Got it. Very good. There's a little olive shell right there, maybe. Oh uh, yeah. Sticking out. Is that broken? Yeah, it'd be broken. No, this one's not though. Here you go. Oh, thank you. Oh, micro guy. Okay. And guys, your sandals are making flowers on the sand, so that's kind of cool. So, my I think mine are pretty boring on the bottom. They're little Nike. Wait, those, those aren't yours? Those oh, wait, these are mine. Yeah, I was oh, going to say. Cow. All right, so there's a kitten's paw. Yep, that go ahead right and there? pick it up and put it in your hand real quick and put it in the light because you can't see it. And so that's complete, actually. Oh. It's a complete clamshell. So something died in there. So hopefully it doesn't open on you. God, I hope not. Yeah, there you go. Very Jeez. cool. Guys, we just uncovered a pretty cool unicorn horn, so I'm going to let Callie take it out. There you go. Very nice. That is a nice sized one. Cool. All right, we'll keep digging. See There's something shiny right down there. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's an olive shell. Should be a nice one. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Beautiful shell. All right. There's a pattern on it too. So it should be a lettered olive. So let me. Yep, a little bit of a lettered olive. So very cool. Oh yeah, that is cool. We're gonna find some more like that. Alrighty guys, look at that little guy down there. We got our first nutmeg. Callie was curious what a nutmeg was. So go ahead and take it out. And there we go. Look at the beautiful patterns on that one. Awesome. We'll keep digging. I'm digging here, and I saw this little orange guy pop out. So I'm gonna let Callie pick it out. There you go. You got your first juvenile conch shell complete. Sweet. All right, Callie is being a paleontologist. Are you having fun? So much fun. So she's found some cool shells so far, some big olive shells. That's not anything, but that's oh. okay. Ooh, there's something right in that right in that pocket right there along the side of the wall. So right here? maybe go ahead and shovel at it again. Might pop it out. All right guys, we'll be back when she finds something. All right, I'm filming now. She found a little baby olive shell, but I think there's something else down there shining at me. So we're gonna keep digging and keep finding stuff. Uh, that's a tiger's claw, that's kind of cool. What's a tiger's claw? So it looks like a human footprint. It's an oyster shell. Okay, cool. Cool. Get right in down there. Awesome, and I think there's something else there too. Just be careful with your. Just Just be careful with your hand. Uh, dig it with your shovel so you don't cut your hand open. What? Because that would be fun on YouTube. You know? Yeah, totally. That'd give me more more views. So that was part of a juvenile conch shell. A little broken. A little broken, but that's okay. All she all seashell hunting is crazy cool. All right. Oh, there's a nice little olive right there. Oh yeah, there is. Very cool. Hey, buddy. All right, well, we're going to keep digging, and then the next thing you'll see is a massive conch coming out. Oh. All 
Alrighty guys, I think we've uncovered a nice olive shell and wow, that's your biggest one yet. It's a very beautiful looking olive shell. All right guys, we're gonna keep digging that spot. I think she's found her honey hole. I was kind of digging and something just kind of dug out there. I, I filled it up, oh, now your, your shovel disappeared, but it's straight down there. So if you just wiggle your uh, hand in there, right in the middle. Nope. Where'd it go? Right there. Oh, yep. There it is. Look at that. Oh, wow. That's a pretty one. It's an awesome auger. One. All right. Awesome auger. Double A. All right. We're turning Callie into a professional digger, and she likes to cave her hole in a lot, which is okay. So, no life has been lost yet. Guys, I just filled in my hole accidentally. But underneath the sand is a gorgeous olive shell. So we're going to let Callie find it. There it is. Oh. Look at that guy. I didn't have to look too hard. That is a beautiful oh, olive so shell that she's taking home to Indiana. Where right. it'll be nice and cold. All right, guys. Got another beautiful olive shell that's about to come out here. I believe. Here we go. Ooh, doggy! Look at that beautiful olive shell. Going home with Callie. Wherever her bucket's at. Uh, well, I'm gonna put it in your hand. Hey, what'd you get? Oh, she got a nutmeg. Very nice. Cool. Another shell? Not that. No, yeah. it's broken. But I've got an olive right there. Oh man! Out. Yeah, let's get that one out. That that's a beaut. Look at that, guys. It is a beautiful olive shell. I think you'd be able to get behind it with your finger and pull it right out. I thought I could, but there's a lot of stuff around it. I don't know if I can without slicing. Well, there you ah, go. There you go. Wow. That oh, one's huge. There you go. That's the one we were looking for. That's the two fingers combined one. Very nice. I don't know if I'd stop caving or something. I should have. Let's try. I don't know what happened to it. There was an off shell here, but. Yeah, way to go. Callie covered it up. Yeah. All right, we'll keep looking. Ooh. Ooh nice. Nice, nice auger. Very nice. No, just kidding. Oh. So the olive shell just popped out. Very nice. Wait, another other show. All show. Nice. Oh, I lost my shovel. That's okay. I've already lost. That was part of the conch shell. Oh, that'd be so nice. Dig along that side of the wall there. Something's gonna pop out. Well, I mean, something already has popped out. Those nice olive shells popped out. So. Ooh, that's that's a freaking monster, man. It's, it's a beautiful a, auger it's shell. The biggest one. Biggest found. one you found so far. One more, and you'll have an earring. An earring set. That'd be kind of cool. Arts and crafts. All right, guys, so what Callie is digging into is really promising right now. So I really think something super nice is about to reveal itself. So we're going to keep digging and keep praying that something pops out. See, I can see it by the end of it. It's going to be a big one. Uh, is it broken? Oh, it's broken. Oh, bummer. I just wanted a small break. Sure you want the big show? Maybe. What are you? You're nothing. Oh, oh man, I'm gonna bring some ibuprofen on a trip like this next time. If you want to shovel that way, it's okay. I'm, I'm done with my hole, so that makes it easier on you. 
olive shell. Oh man. A big one. You're gonna go home with a lot of pretty olive shells. Good old collection with your rock collection. Right, you said you had a you had a rock collection? I do. Very cool. Yeah, hit the uh, get your uh, little shovel right there and dig right right in here. Looks really looks really promising. Guys, look look at the patterns on that shell right there. This is going to be awesome. It may not be complete, but it's still a really cool piece of a shell to find. Let's go ahead and there you go. It's part of a uh, Jinju something shell. It's really cool to see and definitely take that home with you because oh, yeah, those absolutely. are super rare to find full. So very cool. We're gonna keep digging this spot because something cool is gonna come out. That's the olive shell, I think. Yeah, I think so too. Nice. Beautiful olive shell. Love the patterns on those. Big one too. The uh, scallop shell that popped out. Black one. Actually, it's kind of got some little dark colors to it when you rinse it off. It should have some like red velvet and blues to it. Yeah, that would be nice. That would be cool. Yeah, guys. Olive shell popped out. Sweet. A little broken, I think. Yeah, a little broken, but not, not yeah. bad. Not yeah. bad. Very cool. Going home to Indiana. Oh, Susanna, don't you ask me. Oh, it's an Alabama song. I didn't, I didn't even think about that. Alabama's in there. I thought it was Indiana. <laughs> Come from Indiana. Get the banjo on my knee. All right, well, go ahead and uh, bring your colander down here. And let's see what you found. All right, guys, here's all the beautiful shells that we found in the dark. A lot of uh, really nice olive shells and really beautiful scallop and look at this auger man this auger is big that's a big one very cool and then part of a genual genoia shell which you guys will tell me which one which one it is in the comments because you all know i can't speak correctly so <laughs> cool did you have fun i did awesome, awesome. very good all right guys we just got done shell hunting in the dark with callie from indiana and she found a lot of beautiful seashells did you have a good time I did. Awesome. So guys, tune in next time for another beautiful seashell hunting adventure.